a subdivine feminine. Welcome to the karmic circus where we expose all of these karmic -y ass clowns. Divine feminine. I just first I need to tell everybody thank you for all the comments, all the likes, all the subscriptions. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you. I love you. I'm sending positive energy to you. Positive energy coming to you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you for the donations. Thank you for asking me to do your personal readings for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I love it. I love it. I'm glad that you guys trust me. Okay. Um, Divine Feminine. Uh, this deck. I made this deck myself. I ordered these cards online. I actually thought they were bigger. Okay. And uh, so I, I, I got a pretty big deck that I made. Now, out of all of these cards, I've done two two readings back to back. And both of them is showing. Somebody out there loves you, baby. Yep. Now, masculine, you can be up in here, too. Okay. Now, for one, the first word that came out was divine divine feminine then the next card that came out was hostage so divine feminine somebody wants to hold you hostage. This person, the reason they want to hold you hostage is because they married a karmic on you. They married a karmic on you. Okay? Now they're, they have regrets and they're divorcing that karmic. Okay? Even though you and this, even though this masculine married a karmic, he's always had a special love for you. And his friends envy his love for you, okay? Because you are their true love, Divine Feminine. And masculine, if you're in here, you they are your true love. Is somebody out there masculine that you want to hold hostage? Okay? And your friends, your friends, or both of you, masculine and feminine, your friends, they envy how much you love this person and how much this person loves you. Okay? They're judging you. They're judging you. They're judging you. But all they can say is, boy, they truly love each other. That's all they can say. Even if y'all break up and get back together, I don't, I don't even see this in this reading. All I see is good shit. Your wishes come true. Now, a witch came out. Watch Wusa. Maybe you had to. Wusa. Because there, there could have been a witch that was trying her hardest to break you apart. But in reality, the shit backfired and they made you too close. And now this person speaks very highly of you. And they're spoiling you with affection. They have regrets for marrying this karmic. And now they're divorcing this karmic. Somebody's name may start with the letter H. The letter W is out here. Somebody's name may be Will. Somebody uh, is a Virgo. Maybe a Virgo is spoiling you with affection. 
it's financial abundance out here and you are their true karm you are their true um love and they're divorced in a karmic if your name don't start with the h maybe the karmic's name may start with the h now divine feminine divine masculine if this is not your energy it could be a neighbor's energy it could be your your brother's major uh, energy it could be your sister's energy it could be your best friend's energy if it's not your energy it doesn't mean this energy is out here it ain't going nowhere this energy will leave you and go to the next one it's just like just like when you turn a light on and how the electricity shoots through your walls that's how energy is it don't it don't stay still just because the light go off in your house that don't mean the light the power is off that's how energy is okay so yeah this person wants to hold you hostage to find them and they friends they they friends envy how much this person loves you and they are your true love yeah they are and they speak highly of you tell me more yep past relationship this person is from your past but even though they married somebody else and this and that they they still speak highly of you and think highly of you you are their true love even though and that happens you can marry somebody and not be in love with them a lot of people have um married for money um married because their family made them marry or told they listen to the wrong people and and let the love of their life get away from them so this is what it seems like what happened with you and this person divine feminine they married a karmic she could have fooled him or something and um got pregnant and he tried to do the right thing and married her she ended up uh doing him wrong or the baby may not even been his or some shit like that because she was a karmic okay okay so holy spirit tell me some more good news for my precious family members out here precious loving kind sweet generous ass collective family the divine ones the ones with all this financial support abundance out here the ones out here that's being spoiled with affection uh-huh the ones that's out here that's divorcing a motherfucking army uh-huh the ones out here that's getting their justice that's my family that's what i'm talking about you so famous baby they want to hold you hostage mm -hmm. they want to hold you hostage divine feminine with the capital h <laughs> Uh, they want to hold you hostage with a capital H, baby. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. I'm serious. Hostage with a capital H, Divine Feminine. Mm. What is this for Divine Feminine? Very soon. Somebody wants to hold you hostage very soon, but I don't think it's in a bad way, baby. I think it's in a good way. Uh-huh clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you you better get the manifest order one of my pink wedding candles and my love candles from me they only five dollars here's my little pink here's the wedding right here light this candle and call in your loved one call them in ivy wed happily ever after devotion okay you call it in you can't see Yes. Call in your soulmate. Five dollars if you would like to purchase. Yes, I am. I will be having the chakra candles. Um, if you want to purchase a chakra candle, I'm trying to find all the the colors. I'm gonna have to go outside of my city to find like the purples. Um. And the orange, well, the orange, orange is easy to find now because it's Halloween time. It's coming up, but um, and the red is easy to find. The white is easy to find. The blue is easy to find. It's hard to find the purple. All of the colors I can find, except for the purple ones. So I have to go find them. But um, I will have all the the colors of the chakra. And you don't, you can kill two birds with one stone with that candle. After you burn it all the way down, you can use it as a, uh, you can stick a little 
bake flour down in it and make it a little flour base. Mm -hmm. You can give it to somebody as a gift. Okay, so Divine Feminine, very soon, your true love is going to want to hold you hostage, baby. Yeah, they are. They gonna wanna hold you hostage. Oh. I'm sorry. So I got my soda up here taking up much space over here. I dropped my crystal ball. So, it's a cancer energy out here. It's a witch. Somebody's name is Will, and your person is your wish come true, and you're their wish come true. And this person has regrets for marrying a karmic. just pull from my karma cards and see exactly what it is that your masculine was married to and what he went through with this karmic ass energy. Yeah. What did the what did the masculine go through, Holy Spirit? Show me what this masculine went through married to this karmic energy. Tell me what the masculine went through with this karmic energy. So he's divorcing this, this karmic um, divine feminine. So clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Okay, so your masculine is coming to you. But you gotta you gotta manifest him, you gotta imagine him, you got to, you know, you may say, I'll never love again. Don't think like that. Because if you keep saying that, you're not. You're speaking that into existence. You're speaking negativity in your life, saying you're never going to love again. No one will ever love you. All of that type of shit is, is, is um, negative, toxic. Don't speak that into your life. You will love again, okay? You will. You, this person you was with was a lesson. Somebody, um, secrets, statutory rape has come out. So this karmic... Um, could be uh, having some secrets of some they fucked with a child. Backstabbed. This is a challenge. Um, okay. Divine Feminine. It says secrets and statutory rape out here. But uh, I don't feel like your person raped nobody or molested nobody. Uh, I feel like he was backstabbed. And this karmic lied on him. Okay. And this is a challenge for your masculine. Or masculine, you may be, um, have got some sort of rape charge from your karmic and her child. And this is a challenge for you. Tell me more, Spirit. Tell me more, Holy Spirit. Witch behind closed doors secretly. Yeah. The karmic is a, a witch behind closed doors. Don't nobody know. And this is a challenge for the masculine because he don't he don't know that she's a witch. And masculine, if you is are and you are in here. You need to get you some protection. Get you a black obsidian or you can email me and purchase a spiritual healing set from me. Okay, for $33.33. And it'll come with, um, it'll come like this. It'll come with a, um, a healing bracelet or some sort of protection stone bracelet, and it'll come with seven stones. 
and you'll keep these you can put these stones anywhere in your house if you want to put them in your pocket if you want to put them in your drawers if you want to put them in your closet um i mean in your your car uh -oh. you can you can put them you know in different places and uh protect your energy you can use them for spiritual baths if you're just a, a starter beginner and you don't have crystals you can order some for me for 33 dollars for the pack um and it comes with a candle and if you want to order that with the uh, spiritual pack with one of those candles um you can get the whole whole set um i'll what is it i'll uh make it a bundle package probably for $37 or something, you know, you can get one of those candles. Okay, well, um, you need to protect yourself because this, she's a witch behind closed doors and she's not closed doors. She's a secret witch. Okay, this person could wear a ponytail with extreme baby hair. Damn. <laughs> ah, a ponytail with extreme baby hair. I know when I made that, I was thinking about myself. But I'm not no karmic. I'm a divine feminine. You you wearing a, a ponytail with, with uh, extreme baby hair. You're very talented and very creative. Yeah, that's divine feminine. That's you. Mm -hmm. And whatever you create, you're making money off of. Mm -hmm. Why this karmic is a, a, a witch behind closed doors. She may be trying to do some sort of magic to try to take your abundance. Try to project project her energy off on you. She could be a Pisces energy. And and she's mad at the fact that even the masculine hates that he loves you so much. Because she hates that he loves you. Mm -hmm. And she tried to throw a dark negative energy at you because she knows the masculine wants to talk to you. And she don't want the masculine to talk to you. So she started throwing negative energy at him. Um, probably shit to make him sick. Um, make him forget shit. Mm -hmm. Or she'll try to get some morning sex from him. But again... She sucks, starts to dick, okay? And she be telling him he love, she love him, but he don't love her. Mm -hmm. Period. Period. He don't love her, okay? And all, Because he know all she did was come to wreck havoc. And did rituals over you, but it came out in reverse. It ain't working. Because you got queen status, and she got to bow down. Mm -hmm. Playing with the Mickey Mouse... Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse witchcraft and shit. Yeah, Minnie Mouse. Your person may be a blue collar worker. Some of you is going through some sibling rivalry. You're not getting along with one of your siblings. Tell me more for the divine feminine. Tell me more about why, um, what happened with this karmic energy. They blocked their own blessings. Your your uh, your person is telling this, this karmic to kiss their ass because they found out that they was messing with a practitioner and that she was throwing magic on them. Yep. Open marriage, obstacles, no joy and success, unstable energy, sexually transmitted disease, she wouldn't listen. They feel stupid for going against you for a toxic, jealous energy. Stuck in stupid. This person isn't intu intuitive. They don't know how to use their intuition. And they left you for a younger enemy. Mm. Strange things for change. Mm -hmm. Nothing but negative comes out of their mouth and they, they, and they notice it. Your person is now telling this karmic, not my monkey, not my circus. Yeah, he can throw him in the tent. Because this karmic love bombed him. Or your car or your person love bombed them. And they money hungry, greedy people that see you as a jackpot. Or they see your person as a jackpot. There's a Capricorn energy out here. An empath that's into the same sex. They rejected them and now they mad at you. See, that's what I said. This your masculine rejected the karmic and the karmic mad at you because the masculine attracted to you. So don't feel bad about that divine feminine because even if the masculine, if it wasn't you, 
He's still not attracted to her. It would be somebody else. She would be mad at somebody else. So don't be mad at yourself and let her be mad at you. Fuck her. Okay? Showing her true colors of jealousy. Somebody's father. Spirit, tell me a little bit more, a little bit more. I mean, in 20 minutes, I wasn't supposed to go that long. Tell me a little bit more. Teach. They think that you're a fool for them. Do some research. Returning to an ex-partner, they're not. It's in reverse. Same sex karmic and Scorpio. See, this person, some of you may be dealing with the Scorpio, but this person is mad at you because your person don't want to return to them. Like again, even if you wasn't in the picture, your person still don't want to be with this person because they done found out that this person was a witch or a warlock and they feel backstabbed by this person. So this person then, then put them under some sort of investigation saying that, you know, they raped their child or they did some shit to them, but somebody need to do some research or if some research is going to come out. What's going to go on with this, this secret sex statutory rape? Sacrifice. She's making a sacrifice. Scorpio out here twice. Date rape, drugs, spell work, dominatrix, no social media. She don't be on social media. She's a dominatrix. This karmic energy is. She slipped men, date, rape, drugs, and she probably, um, she's sacrificing and, and doing the pregnancy shit. I, I was just going to say it. Slipping drugs in the drinks. Yeah, damn. This is somebody's aunt. Motel meetup. She's setting men up. Well, damn. Divine Feminine. She mad. That gave me a hot flash. That's some hot ass energy. God damn. Ooh, I feel that heat. Let me light some sage. Shit, fuck that. That's some, that's some nasty ass energy. I only got a little bit of this stalk of stage, sage. Yeah, that's some, that's some, some nasty ass energy. I felt some heat right just got right on the side of my leg right here. I just felt heat. Find every spirit and I'm asking you, Archangel Michael, to protect me and my viewers from any negative energy coming out of here from this witch. I I'm asking you to return it back. I reverse and I return it back. Return it to sender in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I am protected. Oh, Lord. Yeah. This karmic is, she a hot mess. Ooh, ooh, she a hot mess. She didn't, she, she does. I, I felt this energy was coming. So this tells it all. She slipped drugs into these men's dreams. Date rape drugs. She 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 slipped. Damn, that's a bitch. She slipped drugs in these men drink, fellas. Masculine, you better be fucking careful. She, ooh, and divine feminine. You tell your brothers, your men, your the men that you love and your family and all that about this energy. It's the energy she is slipping drinks in men's drugs. And having sex with them and then lying and saying they rape her. And how she's getting away with it is because she's not using no protection by with them. And she gets their semen. Easy. Oh my God, guys. Oh, that's scandalous. This is a bitch. That's a straight bitch to do some shit like that. Damn. Divine feminine. I'm sorry that your reading went there, baby. Then she sacrifices the baby. This is a witch. Damn. 
she she claimed false yes yeah, she she claims um she claims rape on these men after she didn't did some spell work and drugs on them. and she's a gold digger and she's sacrificing these males had these men under pressure wow that's fucking crazy also make sure you you share this video because this 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 girl she ugh, she's the damn devil she's a witch they great so fellas be careful about these women that's out here these young girls that's sending you text messages and, and screenshots I call them the Google, uh, the Google, what do I call them? I forgot. Some, but they, they, the Google thieves, they go on Google and they, they, uh, copy and paste, they screenshot. They screenshot fake pregnancy tests, plus and minus pregnancy things and send it to your phones, pray ver verifications, fake, um, um, ultrasounds, fake babies, fake stomachs, all of that shit. So be careful. These are the sacrifices, and this is this this could be for you, divine masculine, too. The hostage part. This this karmic energy could be trying to hold you hostage because you're trying to hold divine divine feminine hostage. Your divine, they say I listen to slow songs and make my eyes cry. Now that's divine feminine. If you're if you're here, your masculine is listening to slow songs and it makes his eyes cry. And if you're if you're masculine in here, your baby mama listens to it. Okay, and that's because you two go through the baby mama drama, but you love each other. Okay, now. I know a lot of time the, the, the karmics can be called just the baby mama, but divine feminine, I believe this is your baby daddy, baby mama, y'all go through drama because of a karmic, okay, put some cheese out for the mic, spirit said, because somebody haven't, haven't been spiritually awakened, okay, and this lust is out here, and the masculine is going to have to get some DNA testing, mm -hmm. he's going to have to. Your masculine may wear corn rolls. He may have just taken them out. Or he may have just cut them. This karmic wishes that they were secretly you. And this karmic is a musty, dirty, sweaty armpit showing through the clothing as karmic clown. Okay. because she's always doing some nasty shit. Somebody's name is Earl. Somebody did something for $5. A truck driver. She probably, this is why she must be in steam because she, she probably run after truck drivers. She hop in their car for $5 and do a little something strange for a little bit of change. Mm-hmm. She's on, she has, she has, uh, she has online false documents and shit. She could be under 21 lying about her age. Hopping in these trucks with these cards with these men for five dollars. Sexual healing, yep. Yeah. She's sexually healing these men. She's a gold digger. Now for some of you, this is a masculine man who a masculine could be doing this too. Okay. This yo yo this karma can be a masculine. That's not healed and that that's wanna be a player and did something to somebody other than you. You're not the only one. And you wasn't getting no sleep behind this person because you spoke the truth to him. Now they feeling lonely. But this person was a spiritual assassin. This karmic is a spiritual assassin. She may drive a black vehicle. Okay. She could be in the hospital. Somebody just got out the hospital from having a terminal illness. This person could have been playing mind games and manipulation tactics, trying to, you know, play them tactics on you or your masculine. 
the color green is here and somebody is parked in the alley watching you. Stop listening, do not react. They want to see you in a negative. Don't walk, I mean, in a negative. Don't. Don't react. Walk away. This is some baby mama drama. She may drive a green car, a green truck. She could be a third party interference. She's the karmic. And she's upset because the masculine is wanting to hold you hostage, divine feminine. And you in a class by yourself, so and you keep a low profile and you're loyal. And his masculine asked you for help. He don't want no help from her. This mas this karmic told the masculine that you was crazy. She laughing and shit. But she's not the masculine's energy. She's not his twin flame. And, and the masculine is about to get a DNA test. When he told her he wanted a DNA test, she told him to shut the fuck up. Because she knows she was she was being deceptive. Mm -hmm. And his masculine told her home is where his heart is. And that's what you, Divine Feminine. And she said, Divine Feminine who? You know who the fuck Divine Feminine is. So she set him up for a false pregnancy for money. That's just what I was saying. So masculine, be careful. That's where you'll be paying for some money and it don't even have to be no fucking baby. She'll just be, if, she, if, if you got a bitch out there and she's screenshotting you everything, don't you give her shit. Divine Feminine, if this is your son or somebody or your brother or somebody going through this or your masculine, tell him, don't him, don't he, he don't give no, no, no karma, no money. Because this is all the plots and setups now what they do. Google makes it very easy to, to do devilish acts online. You can fake who you, you can fake a whole pregnancy, a whole baby. Okay? Somebody is suffering in silence, divine family, because he, you know, I believe this, this karmic has did some shit behind closed doors and the masculine don't want to tell you because he don't want you to leave completely. You've already left him, but he don't want you out of his life. He needs you, and he needs that good, good energy, the big energy you got, divine family. And he needs that in his life, okay? He's in solitude, hiding, afraid. There's a battle of beliefs because you tried to tell him about spiritual warfare, and now karma is hitting him with this karma. Mm -hmm. Yep, it is. Mm -hmm. This karma is a sheriff in a white vehicle is coming to evict this karma. Spirit is saying to, to get out while you can, or they're telling the karmic to get out while they can. And this karmic was very abusive towards your masculine. The devil is busy taking souls. And now they're feeling the heat. Playing chess. They played mind games with you. Mm -hmm. This witchcraft being thrown from this karmic energy. Listen to your intuition and pay close attention because this karmic is an unstoppable force. They have bisexual tendencies and you shut it down on their ass, divine feminine. And they realize that you deserve to be on a, a pedestal because they abused you. They gaslighted you. And you started connecting with spirit. And they ended it because they seen them for themselves, who they was worth, who they was with. That karmic. They seen them for themselves. Now this karmic may be saying she have a secret baby. It may, if it's a secret baby, the masculine, if he ain't seen it and he just seeing pictures, it ain't no baby. That's not for everybody, but it's for somebody. So divine feminine, I'm going to stop right there. I don't went far enough. If this resonated with you, y'all, please hit that thumbs up button for me to help my channel grow. Okay, peace.